Whoa, this is insane. You won't believe what Katy Perry just did. Live in this concert. Check this out. As you can see, she's glitching live on stage like a robot. And as we can see, it's like there's a button on her head, beside her head, that when she touches the button, it can help to rearrange her eyes. This is not supposed to happen to a normal human being, if you know what I'm saying. When we talk about the Illuminati controlling the music industry and controlling these musicians and how these people are industry plants and are puppets, people think we're joking about it, but this is an example of what we are talking about. Hello guys, this is Value Fivara and welcome back to another video. Before we dig deeper, please hit the like button. If you're new, subscribe and leave your thoughts in the comment section. So this clip came out recently on Katy Perry. She's performing live on stage. But as we can all see, during the performance, she start malfunctioning and start glitching. Her eyes are behaving funny. Like if you have watched my videos on AMK Ultra cloning and glitching, you must have seen this same footage. What makes it even more funny and more cringy is that she knows that she's glitching. She knows that she's glitching. And that is why she's trying to press a button around her head. You know, all this AMK Ultra mind control, this is actually what is causing all this rubbish that is going on in the industry. And that is why you, you keep seeing these people be misbehaving and acting crazy and acting like they are being controlled by something else. One very cool example for this video is Luna's X. A lot of you guys think Luna's X is just being normal or just being, you know, just expressing himself, but that's not really who he is. He's just being controlled and being very edgy. All this Satan stuff, all these things, Luna's X would never want to be part of that stuff if he was normal, if he was not famous. But because he's famous, because he's under MK Ultra mind control, he's being forced to do these things. If you go on my video on, on that stuff, you will see a lot of these things. You will see people just glitching and just acting funny. And you'll be like, like, what's the meaning of all these things? Like, it's so crazy to see human beings act like they're robots. We are human beings. Like, we have a mind. We have a thinking mind on our own. We have a thinking mind on our own. And if your mind cannot be controlled by your own self, then you sold your soul to the devil. Simple. Because that's the only advantage we have on this earth above every other creation. The ability to make choices. And all these things comes from your mind. It comes from your mind, from your soul. And people are just walking around like zombies, especially those in the music industry. And also, people also in the world are worshipping these people, thinking that they are the top, that they are like, they are like gods to us living on this earth because of their success. This is satanic and this is idol worship and God warned us in the Bible against idol worship. All this hypersexuality, all this symbolism, all this satanic stuff that you're seeing every single day on your screen. You'll see people that don't believe in God throw up devil hunts and insult God, mock God. And you yourself, like you won't even understand why these people are doing these things. It is not these people doing these things. It is the devil and his elites, his satanic elites doing all these things. They are just using these people as puppets to propagate their dark agenda. And that is why we have to avoid being manipulated or being controlled or being programmed by these things we watch on the camera. Because whether you like it or not, whatever you consume has an effect on your life. For Katy Perry, what we're seeing right here, according to my belief system, I believe that this is just MK Ultra mind control she's being cloned and she's being controlled by a handler that is somewhere behind the stage you know how that stuff goes if you watch a movie called get out you know more about mk ultra mind control hypnosis and how these people are being hypnotized to perform in a certain way to behave in a certain way and we are just being brainwashed or being spellbound by what these people are doing to us, whether we believe it or not. Now, we can't even argue about this thing because some people might want to argue. Katy Perry told the whole world how she sold her soul to the devil. In an interview, which I've played a lot of times on this channel, I don't think I have to do it again. In that interview, she said she wanted to be the Amy Grant of music, but it didn't work out, so she sold her soul to the devil. Now, if, for those who don't know, 
Katy Perry was a gospel musician back when she was a teenager. You can go and look it up, do your own research. So she was more into gospel music. She was, was going around doing concerts around the country, singing gospel music. But she had a different plan. She wanted to become very famous and knowing fully well that gospel music, I mean, true gospel music can make you famous on this earth. She decided to sell her soul to the devil. And that is how she joined the Illuminati. Now her music is so satanic. There's a music called Dark Horse that is purely Illuminati. And you know, I was expecting that as time goes on, probably Katy Perry can repent and leave those satanic stuff to the devil and move on and come back to her original self, if you know what I'm saying. But we haven't seen any sign of Katy Perry repenting from her sin. Katy Perry is still with the other side. And this is just a proof of how people are being enslaved by their desires. The desire for fame, money, and success are all carnal, mundane, and garbage, worldly desires. Because no matter how you get those things, you will never really be satisfied. Katy Perry, I'm really, really sorry for what she's going through right now. You won't believe that the whole Katy Perry will be glitching on stage. I don't understand the fact that all these Illuminati puppets, all these very top class celebrities have to go through MK Ultra mind control so that they can be reprogrammed, they can be rewired. But I was not expecting that Katy Perry at this age will still be doing this satanic stuff for the devil. For the Bible says, what shall it profit the man if he gains the whole world and loses his own soul? Katy Perry right now, she should be resting and having a wonderful time in her life but still finding her doing these concerts promoting mundane things of the world promoting sin promoting worldliness is really just sick and that is why we have to pray for ourselves and also not one thing god is willing to save all these celebrities okay no matter what no matter what sacrifices they did on the other side to get to that level god is willing to save everyone okay no one is supposed to go to hell no one was created for hell so one way or another, we have to contribute to pray for these people, making sure that some of these people will find the light. And it's all about your heart desires. You know, we are not perfect, right? We're not perfect. But the Holy Spirit can also be our guide to help us to differentiate right from wrong and also to can push us. It can also push us to do what is right and avoid what is wrong as time goes on. Make even more noise for my band. 